In 2023, I traveled thousands of miles magnet fishing in my boat. This video is part two of my magnet fishing trip in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. What is going on today, guys? It is absolutely gorgeous out here today. I'm wearing a t-shirt and today we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing. As you guys can tell, I'm already out on the boat and I'm actually headed up river right now to magnet fish a spot that I said we were going to hit a couple videos ago. If you guys have been following my videos, you'll know that we've been magnet fishing right along an old concrete wall recently. And we found us an old vacant lot where it looks like a house was torn down. And right behind that house, we have been finding all kinds of crazy stuff. Now, the last time we were out here, I said I was gonna bring my claw next time. Well, today is next time, and I got my claw. Of course, I brought the magnet also. We're gonna toss that around for sure, but I know there is some stuff in here that I just couldn't quite grab with the magnet last time. So today, we got the claw with us. We're gonna give it another shot, and we're gonna see what we can find. You guys, I can already see stuff. It's pretty shallow in here. Check this out. You might even be able to see it on the camera. I'm gonna go real slow. Yeah, look at, you can see right under the water. Like, what is that stuff? I don't know, man. And I see something right there. That almost looks like a car stereo, like a car radio or something. You can see right under there, man. There's some stuff right there. There is tons of stuff in here, you guys. We've already filmed two videos here and we've already stacked the cart literally over the top twice. And I guarantee you we're about to do it again today. All right, guys, today we are back out here once again. I have my large 360 degree magnet with me. We're gonna start off tossing the magnet for a while. We're gonna see if we can find anything. And then after a while, we'll switch over to the claw and we'll see if we can find anything with this. Did I grab it or what? Come here. I got it. I don't know if it's attached to anything or what. Look it, I literally seen that just sitting in the water. What is that, a phone charger? I think that's exactly what that is, you guys. It is too. LG Electronics, you guys. We found us the old phone charger. There is no telling what the heck we're gonna find here today. And again, you guys, with the 100 million bajillion nails. There's something with some weight. Oh boy, what do we got here? Whole bunch of nails again, of course. But what the heck is this thing here? Uh, hold on a second. This looks like the back. Is this magnetic? I bet you it is. Yep, you guys, that is magnetic, which means this is the like the back of a speaker. I kind of thought that's what that looked like. It almost looks like a car speaker or something. That ain't no subwoofer, that's for sure. Who knows what the heck that thing came off of. And of course, 101 nails again. A little scrap bracket, maybe a little door hinge or something. But look at this here, you guys. Looks like I see some kind of knob under there or something. Or no, maybe not. Looks like just a bolt or something, but doesn't that look like a knob? Like you could, yeah, that's gotta be a knob. It's like some kind of knob connected to a bolt here. Look at that, you can see the little grippies on the on the knob there. Sheesh, man, these nails are ridiculous. Ooh, I think I'm pulling something here. Yeah, we're like, pull, I'm pulling myself to it. Hold on a second. What the heck is going on? Under the old tree here, the old tree shot. I definitely feel something with some weight here. Oh, and look at that. I see something down there with some cords or some wires. I don't think that's what we have, but I definitely see something else down there with some colorful wires. Heck yeah. We'll try and get that in a second. Hold on. Ooh, my goodness, this is heavy. What the heck is this? Couple things, maybe? It's gotta be. Oh my gosh, that's heavy. Oh no, we lost it. We lost part of it, but I still have something. Check this out, you guys. What the heck is that one? 
Is that just some kind of big old steak? No, look at this end. What do you think of that? I don't even uh, know what to think of that. It's got like a square shaft here, or maybe not. It's like flat on this side, and then it's like curved around it on the top there. I don't know, man. That is a weird one. I don't know, you guys. That's a weird one, but we definitely had something we just lost. Oh, look at that, too. What is that? Is that a spark plug? What the heck? I've literally never seen a black spark plug before. They're usually white. I mean, this one's got little white stripes, but usually they're like all white. Huh, that sucker's gotta be old. And I'm gonna guess maybe not from a vehicle. What do you think that one's from? The old spark plug a Oh, I got something here. This might be it. What do we got? Or maybe not. Oh, look at what it is, you guys. Oh, we cost the old kitchen murder knife. And look at, there's some blood on there still. Showtime, five star bread and bagel. And look at, the tips broke off. They whew, shanked them and snapped the tip off inside of them. Oh my goodness. Honestly, I don't know. It just always makes me wonder when you find big old knives like this in the river. More than likely, I mean, it, it probably wasn't used in a crime. But think about it. How many times are you sitting there cutting some bread or buttering your bread and you just look at your knife and you go, so yeah, I think we're gonna go toss this in the river out back. And it looks like we also had a couple other things on there. I did see a bag, yeah, right here. I don't think there's anything in there. There usually isn't. The old Ziploc baggy. who knows what the heck was in that. And for the most part, you guys, it looks like just a bunch of scrap, really. Or wait a minute, hold on. What is this here? Hold on a second. Aha, uh -huh, look at this. I was going to say that looked kind of flat. This almost looks like part of an old flat tip screwdriver. And maybe we're just missing the handle. We're going screwing. Ooh, and then I see the tip of something here. Is that what I think it is? Oh, heck yeah, you guys. I'm pretty sure that is exactly what I think it is. Is that a file? What do you think they were doing with that one? And then I thought, yeah, we got us a big old hinge here, probably off of a door, I would guess, obviously, or some big old cabinet, who knows? We got the old door hinge evidence. Come on, we gotta find that big thing. I don't know where it is. I don't know where the heck it went. It's gotta be, oh, that might be it. No kidding. As soon as I say that, yes, dude, we got it. I, maybe this isn't it, but we got something here whole bunch of stuff you guys yep here we go oh hold on couple things looks like we got another bag you guys look it there's something in that one no nope, just a bunch of mud and water bags always spook me out you guys there's been a couple times where i find bags with stuff in it but we did have a whole bunch of stuff on here it looks like but none of it is what i thought we lost last time but check this thing out you guys what the heck do you think of that? Looks like some kind of handle, obviously. I don't know what this little extra bracket piece here is for. What the heck do you think that handle came off of? And then, you guys, we caught another set of these legs here. I, what did we find, like two pairs last time? I'm pretty sure these are like party table legs, the old foldable party table. And there is like more than one table's worth down there. My goodness. And I also seen, oh my goodness, that almost didn't want to come off this bad boy down there look at that sucker that's definitely like some kind of pin or maybe a it almost looks like a hitch or maybe the decorative top of a fence pole or something i guess i really don't know you guys huh that's a funky looking piece you guys Here we go, I got something. Kinda wants to come up. Oh, I think that's that cord. That cord, yes, it is. Here comes that cord, I'm not kidding you. Oh, whoa, what is that, yo? Nah, -uh. are you kidding me, dude? Oh my goodness, you gotta be kidding me, look it. Yup, that's exactly what it is. 
And that's the cord I was seeing dangling down there. Unbelievable, you guys. This magnet is an absolute beast. I'm pretty sure. Leah, well, look at where I grabbed that. Like on the screen part. My goodness, you guys. Where's the remote? We gotta change the channel. Oh, look at that. What do you got there? TV, video, volume, channel. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, look at who it is. We got some little Frank and a friend crawling around. What you doing, bud? You trying to watch some TV or what? Heck no, get out of here. I should actually throw you over here so you don't get in the way of the magnet. <laughs> There is absolutely no way that that is good for the environment. Absolutely unbelievable, you guys. What the heck do you think we're gonna find next? Oh, here we go. Oh, this might be that thing that we were connecting to before that I couldn't get up. There's a lot of stuff down there, man. No, you guys. Yes, dude. I love finding stuff like this. And look at the whole handle is still intact. Talk about a cool find, man. All you gotta do is sharpen her up. You go cut some trees right now. Push up, push up, push up. And look at what else was on there, you guys. We caught the old office chair wheel. The plastic really doesn't look that old, but uh, if you look at the metal pin on there, that thing is rusted right up. Something with some weight here. A little something. Oh, and look at what it is, you guys. We caught us a screwdriver. Look at all the rust on the shaft there, you guys. My goodness. You guys, this spot is an absolute honey hole. There is so much cool stuff in here, and you just don't know what's coming out next. Now we're really screwing. And look at what else was on there, you guys. We caught the old railroad spike. And of course, this sucker is way too rusted up. You're not gonna be able to see the stamp on that one. pull anything over here i'm gonna keep hitting this wall i think i got something though yeah i'm feeling some weight here we go what do we got here Ooh. whoa a couple things going on there the old scrap stick metal the old scrap stick metal the old scrap stick metal but check this one out you guys what the heck is that thing? Definitely some kind of small metal canister, but it's got like a nozzle on the top. What the heck do you think that is? It almost looks like maybe some kind of car part, but I guess I can't really tell. Some kind of small canister with the nozzle on there. That's a funky one. And I did see a spring on there and a little pipe clamp. What the heck do you think this spring was coming off of? We cost the old boing boinger. Boing boing boing. Here we go, now we're pulling something. Oh yeah, what do we got here? That's got some nice weight. I always love it when we got some weight. Oh my gosh, hold on. We are gonna smack into this wall and it ain't gonna be good, hold on. All right, here we go. Oh, I see some oil spots. You guys see that? You can kind of see the little rainbow colors on top of the water. Here we go, what do we got? Come on. Nice and easy, Buster. Oh, this might be that, yes, this is that thing we had. Oh my gosh, whoa, dude it is. It's a whole chain, like a fence link. But you guys, what the heck man, look at, literally. And I'm pretty sure, yup, you can see the, lot, or the latch here. This is definitely the door off of a chain link fence. <laughs> Unbelievable, what does that say, wards? <laughs> what a find, you guys, unbelievable.
Here we go. That's something. <gasps> oh, what's that? Don't fall. Don't fall off of there. Whoa, dude. Whoa, look it. It's like some kind of gas tank. Like, no kidding. Look it. Well, that's pretty funky, you guys. At first, I thought this was like the gas tank off of a weed whacker or something small. But now that I read this cap here, this is definitely the old brake fluid. We cost the old brake fluid container, you guys. That is super weird. Unreal. Oh man, I was just looking over my footage here because I had to change my battery out. And I don't know how long that's been going for, but apparently my camera's been like glitching out here and there. Hopefully it hasn't messed up too much footage. Nah, -uh. look at what I can see in here. Hold on. Hold on a second. Look at, I'm going to grab that for sure. Hold on. Oh, snap. Got it all chopped up in the motor there. Come out of the mud. Uh oh. Come on. Come on. Oh, I keep smacking that trolling motor. I'm gonna break that thing, I'm telling you. There's something here. Yeah, it's exactly what I thought it was, you guys. Look at <laughs> I could see it just sitting in the water. Unreal. We're like sight fishing now. I caught me the old yellow and purple bike. Look at that. How long you think that one's been down there? My goodness. Womp, womp, womp. Now I gotta keep checking my camera to make sure we're not uh, glitching out here. Here we go. Just grabbed onto something and I can see a whole bunch of bubbles down there. Here we go. What is this? Ooh couple somethings on there super muddy what the heck do we got wash them off a little bit i don't know what the heck we got here whoa Ooh, look at this dude what is that some knobs and switches on there what the heck is going on with that looks like it might slide into something there and then all you would see is this what the heck does that even say you guys i think this one says push to release trip gauge i don't know man those are definitely knobs and switches on there huh and we also had this thing on there and it kind of looks like a window weight almost it's shaped just like it it's heavy just like one i think that's what that is you guys we cost the old window weight i landed on something here yeah it's pulling to us what do we got there we go. Oh, something with some weight. Whoa, wait a minute, you guys. At first I was gonna say this almost looks like another window weight, and it kind of does, but look at the little loop on there. I've never found one like that. What do you guys think that is? That thing's pretty heavy too, I don't know. Ooh, hold on a second. I don't know what this is. First of all, some kind of ugly piece of white looking framing something. But look at this thing, you guys. What the heck is this? Hold on. Yeah, there's like some kind of writing on there for sure. Hold on. What does this say? You guys, check that out. What does that say? Cowles? five seven eight i don't know what to think of that that almost looks like the trailer hitch receiver or whatever you call it that's the part where the ball would go up in i don't know what to think of that thing you guys it's almost got like a copper color to it under there super funky man i landed right on something i'm not even kidding you <laughs> what do we got this time 
Ooh, hitting something else even now. Oh, oh hold on. I hit something real good here. Oh my gosh, it's coming up. Is it? Wow, that's heavy. We're hitting the boat already. I don't like that. The heck is going on here? Ooh, what's that? Oh, hold on a second. First of all, you guys, look at I caught me a big old T post here. That's for sure what this is. But look at, look at what came up with it. It's like a hydraulic hose for something. Oh, yeah, look, look in the water. Can you see that? What is that, dude? Here we go. Oh, I'm pulling it. It's coming up. Yep. Oh my goodness, you guys. What the heck is this? Is this a couple things? First of all, yeah, these are two different things. These are not supposed to be together. This right here is like some kind of gas pump for sure, man. I actually have, literally, I have one of these on, on my gas tank on my boat. Every time before you start your boat up, you're supposed to take this ball here and squish it to get some gas in there and pump some gas into the motor. Unreal, you guys. That is 100% exactly what that is. And look at the word on there, not sure if you can see what it says very good on the camera here. That says Mercury, which is the exact same kind of boat motor that I have. Oh, I wonder if there's a whole boat motor in there. But look at what the heck else is on here. I'm pretty sure this is some kind of strip lighting. That's almost what it looks like, like the old shop lights. They'd go up on top or something like above your shelf and then you'd have like lighting down on the table. Unreal, you guys. We got the whole plug with it and everything. Just look at that metal, man. Chunks of rust on there. That thing's gotta be super old. There is literally no telling what the heck we're gonna pull out of here. Unbelievable. Look at what's on there, you guys. We caught us a 5,000 year old pair of pliers. Wow, I don't even know if that one would be workable again. Look at how much rust is on there. Seriously, holy cow. That thing looks like it would snap apart if I pull on it hard enough. Whoa, shut up. You're kidding me. It still moves? Wow, that sucker had to be greased up good. You guys, and just like that, all the rust is flaking right off of there. Yup, look it, gone. Boom, just like that, this thing looks brand new. Nice. I just grabbed something good, slapped right onto it. Oh, check it out, you guys, no way. Oh, and look at that, I'm almost positive that's like part of a wrench, yup, part of the old pipe wrench. And we caught us a shovel head. Talk about a two for one. That is absolutely crazy, you guys. This shovel is missing the whole handle and the head of it is starting to chip off there. That's how you know that sucker's old. And this wrench here is missing the adjustable part. You guys, this spot is absolutely mind blowing. I cannot believe the amount of different stuff coming out of here. Oh, I just grabbed something way over there. That's, yeah, that's definitely magnetic and we are definitely on there. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Don't smack him in the wall. Yeah, what do we got here? Holy cow, we're dragging this from quite a ways. Oh, that's pretty heavy too. Wow. Oh, what is that? Oh, no way. Or wait a minute. I thought that was another cast iron pan, you guys, because I found two of them here last time. But no, I don't know what that one is. But first of all, what is this? Some kind of old hubcap? It is too. Holy cow, look at you can see the Chevy symbol on there. You guys, what is this even made out of? Look at how flimsy this looks. I feel like I could 
I could just snap this. It's like as thin as a piece of paper. That is pretty cool, you guys. 100% the old Chevy hubcap. It's all dented and beat up, but still pretty cool, man. And then we had this thing on there, you guys, and it kind of does look like a pan or a pot or something until you flip it over and look at this side. Then I don't know what the heck we're looking at. Some kind of vent cover, maybe that you would see like on the top of houses up there? I, I really don't know what this could be. That is a weird looking one. Who the heck knows? Oh, something heavy here. Really? Wow, that's really heavy. Way out here. Oh my gosh. That's like doesn't want to move kind of heavy here we go no right there try and remember right out from that crack in the wall like directly out from there i want to try and throw my claw down there if i can't get this here we go something's moving dude no kidding yes come here come on buddy Oh, 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 I'm slipping, I'm slipping, I'm slipping. Oh, here we go. I got it. Dude, nah. -uh. <laughs> That's it. Or wait, no. You guys, we caught a 10 speed bike, and I was thinking for sure it was going to be the bike for this tire here. But if you look, this bike has both tires still. So there's got to be even more bikes down there. Absolutely unreal, you guys. We are seriously running out of room now. Look at this. Look at what that is, man. A shotgun shell. And look at it, it's still loaded too, dude. Just the old shotgun ammo. And I think you probably still want to be careful about smacking the back of that thing or it might go off yet, who knows? And look at what else is on there, you guys. We caught us a super old lock. What the heck do you think the brand on that one is? My goodness. Wow, that sucker looks old. You can kind of tell it's got like a gold plating where the name is supposed to be. Huh, pretty cool. you guys look at i could barely even see that one hidden on there we caught us the old hammerhead and there is nothing left of that handle tink, 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 tink. but metal like this does not go bad you guys so as old as this is man it would take almost nothing to restore it all you gotta do is push that piece of wood out of there shine this sucker up and put a new piece of wood in and you're going tink tink tinking heck yeah dude absolutely unreal you guys over the top full yet again yet again you guys another super crazy day we're gonna be hitting a series of bridges that we've never been to before in order to get where we are at right now you guys we had to drive like 20 minutes up river and we're pretty much back in the middle of the woods in the middle of absolute nowhere just about now i was looking on google earth there's a couple bridges on this river here we're gonna start off at this one and if we don't find much we're just gonna head up river and keep dipping all right guys today we are back out on the boat i have my large 360 degree magnet with me and alex is also we're going to be throwing the same thing as always there is just no telling what you're going to find so let's get right down to it start tossing around and see if we can find anything here today oh little something on here you guys what is this 
What is that? A rear view mirror, right? Oh, that does look like a rear view yeah, mirror. It's just missing the, the mirror part. I thought this was like a glasses case at first. Holy cow, you guys, that is definitely a rear view mirror. Look at, you can see the part where it would like attach to the window. No way, man. All right, you guys, that was literally my second throw of the day. I already found me the old rear view mirror. What the heck vehicle you think this thing came out of? You ain't seeing nothing in that mirror. Oh, I think I might be pulling something here, you guys. Here we go. I do got something. Oh, this feels pretty good, too. Hold on. Looks like a couple things, maybe. Ooh. First of all, you guys, what is this thing? Kind of looks like the shape of a flower, almost. I don't even know what to think of this thing, you guys. Almost looks like the, it could go in the socket of something. What the heck you think that is? Or maybe it's like the, the base of something, the stand for something. I don't know, man. I don't know what to think of this one, you guys. We got the old flower shape something there. That's pretty funky looking. And then we had this thing on here. I could see this little chain looking loop. What the heck you guys think that one's for? I'm guessing there should be a whole lot more that goes with this. And maybe it's down there, who knows? We got the old something with the loopy on there. And then we had this thing. I don't think this is much. Looks like just a piece of scrap or something. A little bit of cash money. The old tree shot. Watch this. This is how you find stuff go where no magnets ever gone before it might be what it is. oh it does look it is a light bar you aren't kidding i got something here oh yeah i got something with the old tree shot what the heck do i got whoa oh oh my gosh there's a bag or wait is that a bag i think that might be a shirt you guys what the heck I think that is like a shirt or something and these are pockets maybe? What the heck you guys? I almost thought we had a bag of something in there. And check it out, we had us the old railroad spike on there. A little bit of cash money to go with it. <laughs> check that one out you guys. He or wait, no. I think, you know what that is? What? That's a handle off a shopping cart. Or wait, maybe not. I don't know. Man. That might be a light. I think it's a light. What do you guys think? You think this is an LED light or is this like the old shopping cart handle that's maybe just snapped in half? Interesting. I don't know. Pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. Dude, like right here, man. All right, you guys. Alex says he's on something right here. So we're going to check it out and see if we can both pull it up together. Nice, though. That's perfect. You should find it. Do you feel it? Oh, yeah. I'm right on it, dude. Hold on. Let me let me come up here. Bring this bad boy up. Here we go. Nice and slow. It is coming up. Easy, easy. Oh, my gosh. What is that? Dude, it's a shopping cart. You it's the absolutely. <laughs> How the heck did you know Look that? at that. You can see it's that, the bottom well, half. Fine. How the heck did you know that that was a handle for that? What? Oh, that Dang. is. See? Now you just said that. I think that's yep, a shopping, a shopping cart, cart handle. I don't know why. I just wow, figured that. What yep. Incredible gas, bro. Holy cow, because you can see it yeah. snap here. <laughs> I guess you don't see any electrical wires, but that's awesome. Man. <laughs> yeah, we got this one up. This one was not getting away on us, you guys. Unbelievable, you guys. Look at this. We oh, caught the old bottom half of a shopping cart with a whole bunch of sticks in there. Is that what those are? My goodness. So, yeah. All right, here we go. Into the cave. Watch your head. We made her, alligator. We are on the other side of the bridge. Now check this out. This is, I'm pretty sure this is a factory here. I don't know exactly what kind of factory it is, but then just up the way here, I've gotten a little tip before. Right along the shore here, there is supposed to be a ton of stuff in the water. Apparently back in the day, somebody owned a business along this river and they were known for tossing all kinds of stuff in the river. Oh, I'm pulling something, you guys. This is right over the top of where I just pulled out that funky looking bar. I got it too, here it comes. Whoa, what the heck you guys think of that thing? 
Looks like some kind of something with like half a broken ring on there. I don't know what to think of that thing. Obviously there is more to this thing and who knows if it's down there, you guys. It's got a little tab on there. Who the heck knows? I think I got something again. You gotta be kidding me. I'm like three for three right in here. Like I said, you guys, we're, I'm pretty sure this is like we're coming up in the juicy area or where it's supposed to be, supposedly, from what I've heard. Whoa, look at this. Guess it really doesn't look like much anymore, but look at that. That's like not just any old regular metal. That's like almost plate material type. And it's painted white. I don't know what the heck this thing might have been, you guys. Got a couple tabs on the top. I have no clue. Uh-oh. I seriously think this whole tree is like... Unless I'm on something. That don't feel right though i can see that tree down there yeah dude that's definitely a tree down there but i bet you there's some goodies hidden around here it's gotta be no kidding i got some <laughs> right in the tree dude shut up yo you guys no flipping way man i caught me the old pickaxe head and look at look at here this one's got the flat flat tip and this one's got the pointy tip on there multiple rocks you get tin and iron. ting tong ting tong i want to say i have somewhere between probably five and ten of these things and i think one of them out of all of them has the handle on it still and i'm almost positive there wasn't any mining going on here back in the day so i'm pretty sure this was used for logging this is literally something you only see in like movies or video games these are way too cool tink tink Ting. Oh, you know what time it is. It's snack time, baby. Oh, oh my. Oh. oh. He got it. Oh, oh saved it. <laughs> yeah, that might be hard to see on camera. Oh, I'm making a darn mess here, too. We got ourselves a muffler. Maybe at least, maybe it does, yeah. This The purchase tag's still on there. What the heck? Really? Yeah, like, they threw this in here unused. It's time to get funky, 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 funky. To the left now, y'all. Yeah. Chop, chop, real smooth. <laughs> chop, chop, real smooth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got something here. For sure. Heck yeah, you guys. What the heck is going on here? Is this all one piece or what? Hold on. Oh, yo. Oh, hold on. Oh, snap, we're gonna crash. Oh my gosh. You guys, look at this thing, man. At first, I didn't know what to think of this. I guess I still really don't, but that definitely looks like some kind of propeller, doesn't it? I don't know what to think of this thing here. Is that like some kind of valve? Oh, hold on, look at, look at that thing open and close. What the heck do you guys think this is? Wow, that's really cool, man. This looks like some kind of valve to me, honestly. I don't know what to think of this. This is like super weird. Holy cow, oh, look it, look it, hold on a second. There's like a marking on here. See right there, what does that say, you guys? RM, is that what that says, RM? It's kind of what it looks like, and then it says something underneath it, too. Is that like a paint stir stick? I don't even know, man. That is super crazy. Check this piece out, you guys. This is actually pretty heavy. I'm pretty sure Alex found him part of like an RV bumper or something. Because if you look right up here, there's like a bunch of RVs. I don't know if it's like an RV storage park or something. Just before my camera died, of course, you guys, I hooked onto something here. And I should still be on it. Now, if you take a peek right next to this little RV park type thing, you can't quite see it through these trees, but right where I'm pointing, there's actually like a dead end roadblock. So there's a street up here that comes to a dead end. And from what I've heard from locals, back in the day, people used to come down this road and just dump stuff into this river to get rid of it. So really, there's no telling what could be in here, you guys. Yeah, right here, I'm on something. 
Now, if I'm going to be able to get it up, that's a different story. But here it comes. It's moving. Took a little bit to suck it out of the mud, but I think I got it. Yep. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Dude. Oh, talk about a bumper piece. That's like exactly what this is. Dude. Look at this, you guys. Holy cow. What little piece do you think that is? That's definitely some kind of bumper part. Look at, you can still see it's a little shiny under there. Holy smokes, you guys. That's a long one. We just might end up pulling a whole RV out of here yet. Oh, I think I got something right at the end of this dead end road sign i'm telling you this is the spot right here there's supposed to be all kinds of stuff in here or so the tales say holy smokes man whoa, whoa look at that throw holy nails and i was gonna say i bet you get the same thing too unreal here we go I think I'm dragging something. Yeah. And see, now we're moving from RVs to cars and stuff on this side, you guys. This this area is probably super juicy. Oh, this is heavy, dude. Whoa, that's heavy. Was that a leaf spring? Yeah, Holy cow. I found me a whole leaf spring. Pretty sure this is like some kind of suspension piece off of a vehicle, which like I said, is probably to be expected because now we're moving on to vehicles here. You got bumpers, you got leaf springs, you got mufflers over here. I don't even know if you guys really seen this. Alex caught a whole muffler. What the heck you guys? There's something big here, dude. Like something heavy. Hold on a second. Oh yeah, what the heck is this? Oh my gosh, dude, nah. -uh. Now that's a bumper. Holy cow. Yeah, that's a bumper. Wow. That's a whole thing. Oh, that is where the plate would go too. You aren't kidding. You guys, check this out. What is that, a string tied to it? Oh, I got something with a string here. What's going on here? Oh, nothing, just an empty string. But you guys, look at, I literally caught an entire bumper and this is the section where the license plate would go. Holy cow, man. Next thing you know, we're literally gonna find a whole car in here. I think I might have some actually though. Oh, Buster Jones, what the heck? Oh my gosh, this is actually coming up, dude. You got something too? Oh, that's a sign! Yes! No way! Yeah, oh, it looks all now. torn up though. Yeah, a little bit. What the heck does yeah. that say? Well, there's the, we found the darn pulse for it too, bro. Is that a street sign? I can't really yeah, tell. Ah! It looks like a speed limit sign from the the colors on it. Guess, guess, it's so guess. chewed up. That's definitely some kind of sign. And I think I might have the other half of it, honestly. Oh, oh I have Ooh. another sign. Heck no way. way. It's we just doubled it? up. This one's got arrows, Perfect you can arrow. see. My sign, you can definitely kind of see what it is. You can see it's got like the arrows on it, man. That is pretty crazy, you guys. I cannot believe me and Alex just caught signs at the same time. I think I got the better one out of the two for sure. <laughs> Super cool. Either way, man, beat up or not, I love finding signs. Boink. I just stuck to something hard right here. Nice and easy. See if I can get this up. Here it comes, dude. Yup. Out of the mud. Nice and slow. Oh, oh my gosh. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Yes. Help me. Grab that. Oh, it's way over here. Or maybe not. What the heck is that? Is that a sign? 
Oh my god. Dude, holy cow. Honestly, I thought it, I thought I had another sign on there. Get a, take a big old portrait of your family and <laughs> on the wall. Wow, who knows what the heck this big old square frame is for? And who knows what the heck else is in here? That's a welding hammer, dude. Oh yeah. That's the thing oh, we use to break here. the rust Absolutely. off. Bro, no way <laughs> that's cool yeah. right mine looks exactly the same it's oh, just mine's bigger so that just reduces the vibrations from you yeah kind of yeah there. check that one out you guys alex called himself the old rust buster upper <laughs> oh i got something what is that some kind of piping piece or something you guys i think that's like rubber yeah, you can see there's like a metal banding on there kind of holding this together, but that is definitely like some rubber coated piping or something. Well, who knows what the heck this one came off of, you guys. We got the old insulated pipe looking piece. <coughs> oh, I just clung to something. Give me another road sign. <laughs> We got something. Whoa. Oh, no. Whoa. No, you guys, I caught me a whole teapot. Now that's cool, man. There's only a little chunk taken out of the bottom. Otherwise, this thing is like still pretty intact. Just like the one from the Disney cartoon. For uh, what the heck is that? Right on. Little... The movie? Yeah. Yeah, bro. what is, what movie is that? Uh, the Beauty and the Beast, Beast or something? Yeah, yeah. I think so, bro. That's super cool, man. <laughs> you guys, that is an unbelievably cool find. And look at how like still good of condition this looks, really. Like I said, the bottom's kind of chewed out right there. So, I mean, you still couldn't use it anymore. But if you set it up on a shelf just right, I mean, look at that looks pretty cool, man. How old do you think something like this even is? I'm a little deep. This one's definitely going on the shelf, you guys. Look at how cool that looks. Oh, what was that all of a sudden? What the heck? Is that something? Yeah. What is this? Whoa. What? Yo. Dude, holy cow. It almost looks like a, some kind of coil or some kind of, not maybe a spring or some kind of shock. I don't know. That is really crazy looking, you guys. Yeah, with this little spiral. I don't know what the heck you want to think of that. That makes me think that it's a handle of some sort. Huh? I don't know what That's it. crazy looking. What the is heck? That, you got... Is that like a sheath maybe? Does that pull out of there? Shing! Yeah, right. I don't know, right? What the heck you guys think this thing is with the old twisty looking what you call it on there. There is some pretty cool stuff coming out of here today, you guys. You guys, check out this little gear looking piece that Alex caught. What the heck you think this thing came off of? Meow, meow. Some transmission Time gears or that. something. What are the odds of that? That sucker is heavy though. Holy smokes, you guys. We absolutely killed it here today. We got a couple road signs, some RV or some car parts. Who the heck knows? We got some little teapot here and the pickaxe, you guys. Just tons of super cool stuff here today. We went quite a ways upriver here today and I guarantee you there's still tons of stuff left in here. I only got a couple hours to do some magnet fishing today, but we're gonna head down river. We're gonna start dipping around and we're gonna see if we can find anything here today. All right, you guys, we are back out on the boat today. I have my large 360 degree magnet with me and look it, it is literally starting to rain already. But you guys, I was just cruising down river here to go find a magnet fishing spot. I was only going like two miles an hour and I was looking at this. I thought that kind of looked like a stick or something, but you look a little closer. No, that is literally a bike tire, you guys. I guarantee you, unless it's just a tire. No, here it is, I got it, yep. I'm right on it, but it must be shallow in here if you can see a bike sticking out. Literally, I didn't even start the day yet, you guys. 
and we already caught us a bike here if i can get it up hold on oh my gosh i think we are rubbing in the dirt oh i'm bumping on something oh i'm hitting that tree back there that's what's going on i'm not even kidding you yep here it is i got it how does something like this even end up out here man that is like absurd you guys what the heck i guess i shouldn't say that yeah right over this hill is actually a scrap yard it's not the one we typically go to but there is definitely a scrap yard over there holy cow you guys i caught us an entire bike whoa wait a second what the heck is going on here what is this a cord oh it's the other tire you gotta be kidding me. Oh, and there's a peg on there. Look at that. You could go biking with your buddies. Absolutely unreal, you guys. And it looks like this one's been in there for quite a while. Heck yeah, you guys. It is absolutely pouring out here. We gotta hide under this bridge. And look at, I can't even stand up. That's a short one. Wow, it is like pouring out here, man. I almost need like a, like what do you call them? A poncho or like a raincoat? Uh, we're on something here, pulling us right to it. Or maybe not. What the heck happened there? Oh, no, it is. Oh, yo. Oh, my gosh. Dude. Look at this thing. You got to be kidding me, right? Holy cow, dude. That's like a Bowie knife or whatever you call that. Holy smokes. I don't see a name on there or nothing, but dude, look at like, is that blood? I don't know. I don't know, man. I want to think it's rust. See, something like this, this is exactly what makes Magnificent in the Rain worth it for me. And honestly, it is a little bit creepy. You never know what this could have been used for. I mean, this type of knife, you ain't buttering no bread with this thing. Holy cow, man. I can't believe I just found this thing. Unbelievable. We cost the old... What the heck is that? Thought we attached to something. I don't know. Oh, that almost looks like like a handle might go in there. But what the heck do you think that is? Doesn't look like no shovel or rake or nothing. Huh. I don't know what to think of that thing, you guys. Definitely broke off of something. something here like literally right below us yeah nice and easy Ooh, what is that oh that's a tire or a wheel what the heck you guys that looks like an old one for sure do you see a little bit of white paint on there what do you think is that a wagon wheel or something gotta be off a wagon what the heck else would it be off of or maybe like an old kid's tricycle who knows you guys Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Holy cow. Holy cow, you guys. I didn't even know this thing turns on, honestly. I should have been paying attention. Look at that thing. If I'd have been any closer, I think we'd have ended up underwater or something. Let's keep tossing. I thought that might have been something. I do have it. Oh, what the heck is this, you guys? Hold on a second. Look at this little white knob on there. What in the world do you think this is part of? I don't think I've ever seen anything like that before, but you can see it's kind of shiny up here on what kind of looks like the handle part. Something with the old white knob. That's a funky one, you guys. I don't know what to think there. Ooh, 
I think I just snapped something up right there. Yeah, I got something. Oh, what is that, you guys? Look at that. Looks like a couple scrap wires, but that actually looks like uh, part of a control arm or something off of a vehicle. You can tell this part here looks like it might rotate. I think that's definitely what that is, you guys. Some kind of control arm. Either that or maybe some kind of wrench. What on earth is going on down there? Something weird. Ooh, big old knot of something. I see some color. Check it out, you guys. We got us a, uh, looks like a jig here, and it still looks pretty good yet, actually. We got the old fishing jig. And other than that, looks like just a bunch of scrap debris. All right, you guys, we don't have a whole lot of time left here today, so we're gonna do some more poking around at this old concrete wall. We've already found tons of super cool stuff here, and I guarantee you there's gotta be at least a couple more honey holes left around here. So let's toss around and see if we can find anything. Oh, that's something right there. Ain't it? No. Oh, look at you guys. Looks like a bunch of debris and a bunch of scrap wires and stuff here, but what the heck is this with the handle on there? It almost looks like maybe an old fork or a spoon or something, but there is nothing left of the head. I'm gonna guess that little tip on there is one prong for a fork. That is pretty cool, man. Imagine the person who ate with this thing probably isn't even alive anymore. That's crazy. What the heck is that? <gasps> oh my gosh, you guys, shut your mouth. Dude, that is a flipping rifle. I don't know if you guys can really tell, but that is exactly what this is. Oh my gosh, yeah. Look at that's like the chamber where the bullet would load into, and then, yup. Oh my gosh, you guys. How old do you think this thing is? Look at this is where the trigger would be. Pow, pow, pow. There's like nothing left of this thing. You guys, you gotta be kidding me. It's super deteriorated, but uh, that is still unbelievably crazy cool. Look at the stock is like dwindled down to nothing. Pow, pow. You guys, I can't believe I just found this thing, man. This one is definitely going on the wall, you guys, no doubt. I wonder what the story behind this thing is. That is so crazy. There is some seriously old stuff along this wall, you guys. I know there's probably not a whole lot I can do to restore this thing because it is pretty much gone. But if you wanna see me do a little bit of work on this thing, make sure to go check out my restoration channel, The Fisher Restorations. <laughs> Unreal, and that really makes me wonder what the heck else is in here. What the heck? No. Really? You guys, look at how this is in the shape of a football. This almost looks like one of them sad irons that we find, but this thing is super tiny. This is almost like a toy, like a playset iron or something. Check it out, you guys. I busted off a bunch of rust here. You can definitely see the lip on there now. Well, I don't know, man. It's definitely flat and it is shaped just like one of the sad irons we usually find. Ooh, 
Something hanging off of there. What the heck is that, you guys? Got some kind of metal pin on the bottom there, but it looks like the rest of this is all wood. I don't know what to think of that. That is really weird looking. Whatever the heck this thing is, man, it looks like it's just about as old as this thing. Oh, I got something here. Oh yeah. What is this one? Ooh. What the heck is this? Whoa, dude, hold on a second. That looks really cool. What even is that? Hold on, you guys, look at that. You guys, look at this thing. I don't know what to think of this, but it's got some kind of stand on there. And then if you look on this side, there's like some kind of knob or some kind of valve. What? in the world could this be you can see there's like some kind of cylinder in there like maybe some kind of co2 or gas canister unreal you guys we might have to restore this thing too heck is that that almost looks like uh maybe like the top for some kind of toy derby car or something honestly like this is where the person would sit right in there i don't know sure kind of shaped like a car ain't it no wheels on it or anything but i'm guessing maybe this is just like the outer shell we've already found tons of old cast iron toys along this wall so it very well could be you guys huh that one's pretty cool looking Ooh, look at that one, guys. We caught us the shank, the old prison shank. What the heck, you guys? We caught us one snipper off of a scissors. And again, just like that old fork we found, you guys, this thing is rusted right up. Probably from right around the same time frame, I would guess. I don't think you're cutting much with that one no more. <laughs> You gotta be kidding me, you guys. Unbelievable, look at that. We caught us one of them super old school doorknob handles. And again, we've also found quite a few of these along this wall. Some of them are black and some of them are white. I don't know why, you guys, but these are so cool. It's almost like a pool ball style material, it seems like. Super weird. So if you look here, we had 1,320 pounds of scrap metal, but they deducted 100 pounds for dirt, which that's totally understandable honestly and they paid us at 13 cents a pound we got 171 dollars and 60 cents you guys holy smokes i have never seen that big of a paycheck on one truckload you guys not to mention that the back of the truck we had the top rolled down still so it wasn't even like over the top full unreal man now we're talking 170 bucks i could fill up my gas tank like three times Now today we're back out here once again guys, Alex is out here with me today. If you would like to check out his channel, I will leave a link down in the description. And check it out, we got Mr. Pretzel Eater here. You ready to do some magnet fishing? Yeah. yeah. Alright guys, so we're going to get right down to it here. We're going to start throwing our magnet in our little honey hole and we're going to see what we can find today. Whoa, what do you got? Something blue. Look at that. Your first find of the day. Oh, you know what this is? What? It's like a piece of chain, but it's oh, got... It's for a swing set. Yeah, it's for a swing, swing set. set. That's Absolutely. exactly what I was going to say. Yeah. The old swing set chain. Yeah. 
like, could you imagine if there's an entire swing set down there for all the stuff i've already pulled out of here i would not doubt it dude Gears. all right guys we are back out on the boat today i have my large 360 degree magnet with me owen is going to be throwing the medium 360 and alex also has a large 360 triple threat today we got three magnets in the boat all right guys so we're gonna get right down to it start tossing around this wall here and see if we can find anything today Oh yeah, no kidding, look at that one. Check that one out, you guys. Alex caught himself the old garden hose sprayer. That's beyond He ain't spraying no water out of that one. Little, uh, little chrome dome. What is that? A little chrome dome. What the heck? <laughs> a chrome dome. What uh, the heck is that? Look at, no, there's like a little, a little lip on there. Like you could pour something out of there. I don't know. Oh, Ain't yeah, it? Look at no, Yo, you're right. There's That's a little lip on there. What do you got? Something what there. What the heck is that? Looks like yeah, some kind of little bracket. Nothing too fancy. A little bit of cash money, huh? Yeah, I think I know what this is. Though. What? I think it's supposed to hold the bridge, a bridge up. Maybe. Bro. All kinds of whoa! This is an Something with a cord on it. It's uh, an ignition coil. An ignition coil. This what is that? Your, this would go to your spark plug, and this is where uh, the little four cylinder here. Really? Yeah. Huh? For like From a vehicle? The, yeah, absolutely. Holy yeah, cow! For a four cylinder. Uh, my guess would be like a Focus or something like that. I've never kind seen nothing shape. like that before, but you would definitely know more than no, me. No, this is absolutely. I think I know 100. percent Wow. Ooh, the heck is going on here? Couple things here, you guys. First of all, look at we got the old Cash Money Railroad spike. And I actually figured out, you can't quite see it from here, but right on the other side of these trees, there is a railroad. So that kind of makes sense, but that's still quite a ways away. And then you guys, what the heck is this color on here that I see? Oh, look at it's a little baby spoon. It's a Winnie the Pooh. Here you go, you hungry? <laughs> And check this one out, you guys. I'm pretty sure this is part of like a, a <laughs> clamp or a, what the heck do you call that? C-clamp? Yeah, it's a C-clamp. What is this? What is that there? It's a little thing with metal. Oh, okay. A little thing with it. metal, huh? Let's see. Let me see it once. What the heck do you think that is? Oh, I know what this is. This is a little pencil sharpener. This almost looks like one of them ones that you'd see inside like the bottom of a crayon box or something. The ones that are built in there. Huh, that's kind of funky. Maybe not, I don't know. All right, you guys, right off the bat, we are finding some pretty cool stuff. That's what it is. The smallest horseshoe you've ever seen. Yeah, no way yes. oh my gosh i'm pretty sure that's that literally that is. is a horseshoe that is pretty darn cool man no. look at the look at the texture on the front there what the heck it's in pretty darn good shape dude that is really weird that is really cool i've never seen one that tiny it's like the size of your thumb <laughs> right that is crazy you guys look at this little tiny horseshoe that alex caught i mean look at in the size compared to my hand that's got to be for like a toy something because then it definitely ain't for no real horse <laughs> Don't forget to put the horseshoes on. I pulled up something last time. It was like a brake fluid container. Really? And I thought that might have been the spill, but no, you can still see it. So there's probably something else down there yet. I think I have what's making that. I think I have what's making that. Ooh! Look at this, you guys. Holy cow, there's no handle even on that thing. Look, I got me a big old knife. That's a bread knife from 100,000 years ago. Look at that thing. Whoa. Something white. What do you got? Something white there. Look at that. Some kind of pole for something. You can see the rubber oh, bumper on the end. There's a little guy. Huh. Looks, oh, yeah, and then it, you, it tapers off so it might connect into something else. What the heck do you think that might be for? It's the old beating stick. <laughs> what else you got on here? Let's see. Ooh, what the heck do you think that one might have came off of? Hold on. This is supposed to spin or something, I think. It is. Kind of looks like it, huh? Oh, That's I weird. I, this is. I. I know what this is. Huh? It's like a little. It's like a little dollhouse that that you can hang or 
clothes up on here. It might be something for like a dollhouse or some kind of toy set. Because look at this. Doesn't that look like a coat hanger or something? Yeah. I don't know. Or maybe like some bike handles. It's kind of funky. <laughs> and other than that, oh, I was going to say a bunch of nails. But look. You know what that is? Oh, it's a hook. Check that one out, you guys. He also had the old fishing spinner on there. Looks like the spinner's still good, but that hook is trashed. All you need is a new hook and you're going fishing. Yeah. A bunch of, oh, got the old lead pipe. No, that's not a lead pipe. Look at it. <laughs> no, that's like, oh. a, that's like a fishing, uh, what do you call it? A gaff. Oh, a I fishing no gaff, yes. G-A-F-F, -F, I think yeah. is how. What, what, Google what that. A uh, uh, fishing gaff. It's got like a hook on the end of it. It's like if you catch a big fish, instead of using a fishing net, you use that to like whew, reach down over the wall and like stick the fish and lift them up. What is that? Oh. What is this here, you guys? I got something. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, dude. I thought that was a gun. I thought for sure that was a gun. It's My like heart drill, stopped. Or... Yeah, yeah it's just a drill. Holy cow, man. I thought I pulled up the old banger. Fa, 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 fa. Oh, you smell that oil? Smell that. Holy cow. Huh. Holy cow, you guys. How old do you think that one is? What's the brand on that even? It is absolutely jaw-dropping how much stuff is seriously back here. We've already filled the boat multiple times and I guarantee you it is not gonna take long to stack this up again. What the heck, you guys? Some seriously crazy finds. What is wrong? <laughs> what the? Dude, hold that up once. Hold, hold that up. How, how high can you hold it? Like oh, holy cow! <laughs> Look at this, you guys. I know there's a lot of nails in here, but what in the world? Oh, I got something. Yes, sir. Why does that feel so heavy? Can't oh my see. god! Oh, I think it is actually a cannonball. No, I think it's I'm not even kidding, dude. Yeah, I think it, I think that I know looks that just is. like that, what do you call it, grape shot? No, actually, I don't know. Actually, I don't know. That, that, I can even see like the little nipples. Oh. That looks like identical dude. to what I found before, bro. Now, hold on a second. If, if this is what I think it is, I believe these are actually explosive yeah right. like i'm pretty sure yes it is filled with gunpowder i believe so now when you think of a cannonball you're probably picturing like the movie size cannonballs that are like as big as bowling balls and i can't remember if this one specifically is called like a grape shot cannonball or what the heck but you guys i am almost positive that this is an actual cannonball and like from what maybe the civil war who really knows you guys now that is an absolutely killer find man we're keeping this one for sure the oak Ooh, the heck I landed right on something dude that is the craziest feeling it almost feels like I got it wedged or something but oh no it's moving man oh this actually feels wow hold on a second what is this, you guys? This is like really heavy. Oh my gosh. Is this actually gonna come up or what? Oh, no. Look at what it is. It's a whole bike frame. Oh, and look what's on there. Shut up. Oh, a fishing lure. Heck yeah, dude. Look at that fishing lure, man. It's missing a couple hooks on there. Yeah, actually both the hooks are gone, but dude, all you need is a couple hooks on there. You go on fishing, baby. Plus, you guys, look at this bike frame, man. Just looking at that color, it, plus all the rust on there, no doubt this thing is ancient. Don't, what is that? We got a little bag of goodies tied up in there. Oh, <gasps> dude, shut up. There's something in here. There's actually something in this bag. I am not even kidding you. There's something hard in there. Oh, it's just a rock. Dude, I don't know what that was. Oh, I think I know what this is. You know what this is? What? 
It's the it's it's a shirt hanger or a coat hanger. I think that's exactly what that is. Good job, dude. There ain't nothing left of this thing but the cash money frame. Oh, you know what that is? Is it an iron? Yep, is that what it is? it's exactly what it is. Yup, check it out, you guys. Alex caught himself the old sad iron. Yeah, there's a little bit of a pattern on the phone. Yep, looks like a shape of a pizza. Tightly. Yeah. What do you got, dude? No, big. What the heck is that, man? I, oh, you know what I think this is? Oh yeah, I know what that is. What do you think? It's the can of nails. Can of nails. It almost looks like a can. I think this might be part of like a suburb woofer speaker. What do you got there, dude? A friend in there. Looks like a little, uh, no, no, I don't think you got no friends in there. That's some kind of spring. Who knows what the heck that one came you can off see of. see some color on there. A little bit of color. Oh, look at that. The big shovel. <laughs> oh, you know what that is? Let me see that. You know what that is? Watch this, watch. It's the old mud remover. <laughs> That's what we need for the boat right here. Keep that on <laughs> the, the boat dustpan. Oh my God. Can I sure, bro. Looks like oh a chunk of like a What do you got? Oh Ooh! What is this, dude? No way. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it looks like a motorcycle <gasps> cylinder. I think it is. Yeah. Or like uh, the cover. Like the motorcycle seat or the gas the tank. Gas tank. Yes, the gas thank tank. You. Good call, bro. Oh. You're absolutely right. Oh look at there is a name on there. Oh my gosh, you guys. So Owen, right. you just literally yeah. caught like the gas tank off of a motorcycle, yeah. buddy. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Holy cow, you guys, I'm gonna try and rub some of this off, maybe see if I can see the name on there. Yeah. Honda! What in the world, man? The old Honda. So would that be a motorcycle yeah, then, or would yeah, that be like yeah. a moped or something? Honda's more popular than Honda. Holy cow, no, dude. Awesome. Doesn't that make you wonder, like, is just the gas tank down there, or is the whole no, motorcycle like down there? There's a lot of oil down there. Oh my yeah, gosh, you guys. That's epic fun. Nice job, buddy. Oh, look at this. It's got the it's wing on the side, too, still. You can't really see it. Holy cow, That'd buddy! That's the, the, the cap. That's the cap. Yup, right? the gas cap but right here. That's where you'd fill the tank up. Figure out what kind of a model or something Dad, that was if you. Had, wow. You look inside up there. Did you get that? Is Excellent the color fun, red? Man. Yeah, it's painted red. Heck yeah, dude! Unbelievable! You pulled that thing up with your little magnet. That thing is a beast. You're a beast, dude. <laughs> Heck <laughs> yeah! Oh, that's a super table. nice yeah, one. Whoa! Sure. Look at that, man! It looks like someone painted that. Like. Oh yeah, like custom. Custom painted for sure. What the heck yeah, is that right? spear looking the thing? The what the? Spear, man. No kidding. That is straight up a yeah, spear. What the heck is that? Huh. What's the other end that look like? No way. Huh. You are not going to believe. Whoa. Is that. Oh, you know what this is? Yeah, it's a toy game. It's a foosball oh, table yeah, yeah, for thing. Sure. <laughs> the old yeah. foosball yeah. table people. Absolutely, man. <laughs> crazy. What in the world? Super cool stuff. You know what's crazy? I actually found a piece of this last time when I was really? here. Or maybe not the last really? time, but a couple times ago. Maybe that handle that I found before. Holy cow, you guys. I wonder if there's a whole foosball table in here. Might be the oh, handle for it. that is the handle yeah, for it. You aren't kidding. Be... You caught this? Yeah, yeah. I, I caught what the that. heck? That first That's times. crazy. Super oh, cool, look at The head is off. Yep, yeah. that guy's missing his head, huh? Ah! Ah! Unreal, you guys. And looking at these people on here, I would guess this thing is pretty old. Super cool, dude. You caught part of the old foosball table. <laughs> you got something on there, bud. Bro, let me see. Bro, bro, no way. Bro, look at that. Whoa. What the heck is going on there? First of all, you got a railroad spike. Got two the old a little cash money. No way. I caught a battery. Oh, you did catch a battery. Check that one out. Let me see that. It's not too strong. It squished the battery. Check that one out, you guys. The old Walgreens heavy duty. Definitely don't think you're charging nothing no more with that one. Oh my gosh, it's coming up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's moving. Oh, oh my gosh, dude. Get your magnet on there. What is this? Oh, that's it. That's it. I just seen it. That's it. Yes. 
Can I drop it right on top of it? Yeah, just start. Everybody just start throwing your magnets in here. We gotta get this thing up. We gotta get this up. Now that I've seen it, I know what it is. I know it's in there. I dropped on it. I caught it. You caught me. Oh my god. And I catch you. We're gonna have to get the cloud. Here it comes. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Catch it. Hold on, I got it. I think I'm. No, 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 I lost it. You guys, this is gonna be insane. Do you have it? Here we go. Here we go. Hold on. What is it? What is it? Wait, no. I think there's like parts of it. There must be more going on here than what I think. Pull that up. That's a bike. Gosh. There's something else going on here, bro. Hold on, hold on. Jesus. What is going oh, it's on? It's attached to like a tree or something. Hold on, let go. Let go. Let go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy cow, wait. What is going on here? This is way too heavy to be a bike. We got one. Oh, there's two. There's two bikes. Oh my gosh. That's what's going on here. Holy cow, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> and I still think, cause bikes don't leak oil, man. So I still think there's something else down there. They're coming to get you. No. You found a motorcycle. <laughs> They're coming to get you, dude. No. Yeah. Here they come. Unbelievable, you guys. And these bikes are tied together, look it, by this like rope or it's like a string. So I don't know what else is going on here. Whoa, what is that now? What is, dude, there's so much stuff just tangled in a big massive pile. <laughs> what on earth, yo? Wow, well there goes our boat space. No kidding. And the plastic, you guys. Last time I was here, I literally pulled out, a, a, I want to say, a couple pounds of plastic. Oh my gosh, look at what's in here. What the heck, man? There was a razor literally inside this plastic bag. That's a little weird. Unreal, man. Look at this big old pile of stuff here, you guys. That's like a table or something. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Part of a table, something. You guys, first of all, I don't know what this big old tangled up mess is here. Maybe part of a frame from a table or something. It's hard to tell. This thing is a mess. And there was literally two bikes tangled up in this mess here, you guys. Unreal. Oh, you found the other end of the string? Dude, there's something else on That's here. what I was saying. I thought it might've been tied to something. It is. <gasps> Keep pulling. Oh my gosh, what is going on here? Yo! Is that a volleyball net? I think it is. Oh, and there's lures oh, in there, you guys. Oh yeah, my goodness. For sure, man. The fisherman's <laughs> nightmare. Yeah, the fisherman's nightmare, but the magnet fisherman's cash money <laughs> pot. Look at this boat, man. Unreal. Boat. We, yeah, like, we're running out of room, dude. Can't even move. <laughs> you guys, look at all the mud along the boat here and on the floor. This boat is just absolutely destroyed. <laughs> That's what I thought that was. Spade. Yeah, for sure. Missing the handle on there. I'm dragging something here, man. Ooh! You guys, check this out. A whole bunch of stuff on here. At first, I thought I was just seeing like maybe some rebar pieces, but then I flipped it over and look at this thing, man. What the heck is that? Some kind of coil looking piece or something. Oh, look at that. This side's got like teeth. It's got like gears. What the heck do you guys think that one is, man? That's a pretty funky looking piece, huh? Pretty cool, man. There is some funky stuff coming out of here. Got us a little wagon wheel. Oh yeah. That's like not even off a wagon. That's like too tiny like to be off a wagon here. but it's like too big to be off a toy car almost be a lawnmower or something. maybe it is like a bigger sized car or like a like a toy tractor maybe no yeah we got a big old shovel dude that is like the oldest looking shovel head i think i've ever seen in my life this is only a small piece of what i had though man that magnet was much heavier Super you guys cool this thing screams like 50s Oh my gosh, like look at, look at how, food things!
Ooh, this stopped me right in my tracks. Guys, look what I caught. Hold on, I got something on here. Oh, One second, oh, we're leaking oil. I see more oil spill. What the heck is this one? Ooh, what the heck is that? Dude, oh my gosh, look at it, dude. First of all, what do you got? What the heck is that? Some kind of big old bracket piece with the bolts in it. Dong. You guys check it out, man. We got us a big old wagon wheel or something here, but that does not explain what that little oil spill was just coming from. You guys look at this cart, man. The entire boat is literally leaning to the side. I'm gonna go ahead and take one more throw here today for good luck and I'm gonna see if I can find anything. Whether I find something or not, this is my last throw. Here we go. Throw it. Oh, good luck. Oh, I think I might have stuck something already. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh, Pulling us right to it. Hold on, wait till we get above it. Hold on, buddy. I, get down. I don't want you like that. Oh my gosh. That's, oh my gosh. You have it? Dude, this is seriously heavy. Oh, oh my gosh. I see, I see. What is that? No. No way. Holy cow, hold on a second. First of all, look at this. There is literally two window weights and they're tied to a string here. That's pretty cool. And didn't you find a couple today? Uh, three. Well, two you and found and three? Two and a half. half. Yeah, one of those Holy cow, so that's four and a half window weights here <laughs> today. And these ones are tied to a rope. That's pretty crazy. I wonder if somebody was using these as like Sinkers, sinkers or weights? Sinkers. <laughs> Actually, yeah, right? Yeah, I don't know. Like maybe bolt weights? Yeah. Well, maybe. Or I mean, a um, like boat ballast. anchor? That's why I said, like, it could be ballast weights. Huh. But, you guys, look at this thing. I don't know. Oh, what the heck? At first, I thought it was, like, some kind of box, man. I almost thought we caught, like, a yeah. cash money right. box like or a, something. Like a drawer slot. Yeah, right, shape. exactly. Yeah. Like a drawer money box. But what, what do you think? I, I don't know. Look, at there's, like, some kind of pipe uh, coming off yeah, the yeah, end yes, here right okay. there's a hole on this side check that out interesting yeah i don't know well, I thought, yeah i thought that was a latch <laughs> huh it still yeah. does kind of look like some kind of box yeah. i don't know man that is really weird yet again we absolutely stack the boat you guys there is so much cool stuff in here I, there's not many spots that i have magnet fished like this one now check out this spot, you guys. We have never been here before. Now, not only do we have a bridge on each end of us here, but you can kind of see this little smokestack over here. There is two factories right along this shoreline behind us. It's a pretty secluded area, so really there's no telling who's coming out here to dump stuff. There's no telling what's been dropped in here. As always, you just never know what the heck you're going to find. So we're going to get right down to it today. We're going to start dipping our magnets down the river, and we're going to see if we can find anything. All right, guys, today I have my large 360-degree magnet with me. Now, the game plan is going to be to start at this bridge here, and we're going to work our way down the river to that second bridge that I showed you guys. Alex is also going to be throwing a large 360 degree magnet. I have a pretty good feeling we should find some juicy stuff here today, you guys. Fingers crossed, let's start tossing, see what we can find. I got something here. This is my second throw of the day. I'm already sticking something. Heck yeah, what the heck we got here? Hey, I think this is one of them uh, railroad pins or one of them train car pins. You guys, we have definitely found a few of these before and every time we find them, it's right next to the train track. Super cool, you guys. Second throw of the day, literally first find. We got the old cash money railroad pin. <laughs> Stuck something here. Yep. Here she comes. I got this time. 
Aha, check it out you guys. First we found the old railroad pin. Now I found a railroad spike. In this spot here, it makes total sense because the railroad is right there. But most of the time we find these things what it seems to be like nowhere near railroads. These things are everywhere. The old cash money spikeroo. Right on top of something. Uh, Damn, Christian here. Little salty. Ooh, it's actually pretty darn heavy, man. Uh oh, look at this. He caught the sewer system. Yeah, yeah, right, dude, for sure. We got the water pipe. And then we got. And then we got like this really sharp rebar or something. Oh. Dude, what the heck? Yo. Whoa, 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 what is that? Oh, dude, it's wrapped in a package. There's oh, there's man. packaging on this, I swear to you. Really? Look it. Oh, yeah, what the heck? Dude? Oh, my gosh, dude, should I even open that? Heck yeah. What is that? Special delivery. <laughs> dude, dude, <laughs> look at what is it? Yo, look at there's like terminals on there. Is this a battery? Could be. Could be, but why? What's this, dude? Look at, I'm looking in there. What does that look like to you? Look at that. Let me see that. That's freaky, man. That is really weird. You guys, I don't know what the heck to think of this thing, man, but obviously you can tell this thing was wrapped up and the way it was wrapped was like, it was taped like a package. I don't know, man. This is super, super weird looking. We caught us a small package deal. What the heck is this? Ooh, buzzing like a <laughs> Oh, right there. That's the money. Yeah, what do we got here? Oh, what the? Oh my Holy gosh. The heck, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Holy debris, you guys. I'm sure whatever this factory had going on there, that probably explains all this debris here. Cause wow, look at that. It's like nails and just a bunch of scrap bits. And I know that's not what the bottom of the river is made of. Holy cow, you guys, look at that. Unreal. Oh my, I just stuck something super hard. And it's coming right with. Oh, here we go. The heck is that? Oh yeah, look at that. What the heck is this, you guys? Some kind of, I don't know, but it's got like a circle cutout in here. Looks like they stamped it for something and chucked the rest in the garbage. Well, that's a funky one. Probably just some manufacturing scrap piece here, which makes sense because we are now coming up on the second factory here. Like a horn or something. What in the world? Oh yeah, that is funky looking. Yeah, like what the? On and there's like some sort of mechanism on the inside there. Like, like it did something maybe at I'll, some point. Maybe it is a horn or yeah, a bell right. or something. It's like a diaphragm or I don't know, man. That's kind of cool. Pretty darn cool. Heck yeah. What the heck do you guys think this is? Let me know down in the, down below in the comments. You guys check out this thing that Alex found. I don't know if it's like a horn or a, a bell or something. You can see there's like a little lever mechanism under here or something. I don't know what to think of this thing, you guys. That's kind of crazy looking. Oh my gosh, I just smacked something. Oh, and it's coming up. Whoosh. I smacked it. Wow, that stuck pretty good. Oh, we got me some chain and look, dude, it's still got the lock on there. Oh, that's kind of freaky, actually. Think about it. Why would there be chain with a lock on there? It's like somebody wrapped something up, locked it, and maybe tried to toss it in the river so it wouldn't be found? Who knows? That's like you put this around somebody's ankle and tie them to a brick, <laughs> toss them in the river. I don't know, dude, that's kind of wild. Ooh, I 
I just slipped off. I have a little something. Looks like a wheel. Heck yeah, dude. What is this now? That's a cool looking one, bro. Oh, look what I got. I got like part of a big old spring here. What do you got? A wheel, look at this. Oh yeah, one. it is a little wheel. Look, look at, at that one. What the heck do you guys think this spring came off of though? You can definitely tell it's busted, so I don't know how big it was supposed to be. Boing, boing. Some more cash money nonetheless. I think it's just a big old structural support. At least most of the weight was. Yeah, dude, heck yeah. Some more cash money. Oh my gosh. Insane. Look at this, you guys. I thought I just had a just an ugly looking pole. Yeah. I wasn't even gonna tell you about that. But look at here. Look at, hold on, let me get this off. Ha! It's oh, part of my golf club. Certainly, bro. And no. it's the old left-hander too. No kidding. Four. The three iron. <laughs> Super cool, you guys. You ain't going golfing with that one no more. And look at what else is on there. I caught me one of them little itty bitty tiny wheels that Alex caught already. I don't know what these are coming off of guys. Maybe some kind of small shop cart, who knows? And look at that. I didn't even really see that one on there either. Wow, there's a lot of hidden stuff on this one, you guys. Looks like some kind of cylinder steel, solid steel piece here with a hole in it. I don't know what to think of that one, man. The old factory tube. Oh my goodness, look at that. Whoa, that's that's cool. super cool. That's definitely gotta be a wagon wheel. Look at that. Yeah. And it's still got the rubber on there and everything. Holy cow, you guys, look at that one. Whoa, that. the old like captain's a... wheel. <laughs> right, for sure. <laughs> yeah, what the heck do you think this is? I don't you think know. It's a ship steering wheel look at it, it looks like, like all the things wheel. are broken off though. Yeah, okay, like every okay. one of them look like broken, was... doesn't it? Yeah, it kind of does look They all look sheer. snapped off. Yeah, you got a little side. Yeah, dude. Look at that. 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 Whoa. Oh, that is cool. Oh, yo, there's a gauge on it. What is that? Hold on, you guys. Huh. Look it. There literally is a gauge on there. Tink, tink, tink. What the heck? Do you? It might be some kind of pressure gauge or a temperature gauge, right? Yeah, I don't really know. That's crazy, you guys. And then what the heck? Yeah, like some shaft goes into this tube here. Is it too cloudy to read? It's way too cloudy. Yeah, you can't read it. I do see a little dial on there, though, but I can't see if it's numbers or what. I don't know what it is, but that is super cool. The old something with the gauge on there. Whoa, look at this. What the heck? Looks like just a piece of scrap at this point, but you can tell it must have been some kind of big old bowl or something. Look at that material. That's definitely like uh, like plate material or whatever you want to call that. Now, other than this factory here, there is a bar on this side of the river. I don't know what it used to be back in the day, but today it's a bar. So maybe that could explain what this came from. Who knows? This is definitely part of a bowl for sure. Aha, uh -huh. check this out. We got a little human evidence. I see a little can of worms over there. This could be the old dumping spot up in here. Who knows? Ooh, that's pretty heavy. What the heck is this, dude? If I catch another pipe, oh, it's not a pipe. Whoa, look at that spring, dude. Boing, boing. That thing's massive. Holy cow. What the heck do you think that came off of, you guys? That ain't no spring or off a couch or a chair or nothing. Oh, that was something.
Was it? Oh yeah. What the heck we got here? Oh, dude, no. Shut up. It's a one of the a super old roller skate. But look at you guys. I have never caught one with all four wheels still attached. You guys, that is way too cool. We found these old school roller skates before, but like I was saying, I we maybe we found some with the wheels on them, but I don't remember. These things are super cool, you guys. That's where your foot would go right there. Unreal. Heck yeah, you guys, let's keep tossing. Look at that sticking off of there, you guys. What the heck is that? I saw some teeth on there. Yeah, look at that thing. There's like some gears or some teeth on that thing for sure. What the heck do you think that one is? I don't know, man. The old something that spins and turns something. I don't know. My. Oh, is that going to come up? Oh my gosh. Uh, probably don't want it to, or do I? Oh my God. Whoa. Yo. What the? I think we just got some piping going on here, but hold on a second. Whoa, man. What is this? Ah. Oh, oh, oh. We're gonna put a hole in this boat yet. We all right? Sorry, baby. My bad. My poly boat. You guys, look at this thing. It looks like some kind of water pump. Like, yeah, look at This is the spigot where you would boop, 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 and the water would come right out of here. Heck yeah, for like a well. That's pretty crazy, you guys. What does that say on there? Woodford, Woodford, Des Moines? That's pretty cool, man. I caught me the old well pump. Look at this thing. That thing is absolutely massive, you guys. Thirsty? Yeah. See, now they're coming to get you, dude. God, you can't do nothing right. Unreal, you guys. We caught us a whole water pump, the old well pump. That's wild, man. I'm gonna see if I can just stick my hand in there and grab this thing. I can see, you guys see that? You can kind of see something white sticking out of the water. Uh, oh, I got it. Ooh, what the heck is that? I just seen that sucker sticking out of there. I don't know. Almost looks like just some kind of plumbing or something. This looks like some kind of tube here, dude. Is that another part of a toilet? You have literally got to be kidding me. That is so disgusting. I don't know. I don't know, man. That looks like that's where your goes down the tube there and you flush it. I don't know. I think we're definitely going to have to come back to this section of river because it really didn't take that long to fill this cart up. What a day, you guys. Yet again, we filled the cart right to the top, stacking up that cash money. And again, we found tons of super cool stuff. Today we are back out here at this old concrete wall. Alex is out here with me once again. And today we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing. Every time we come here, we overload the boat. So we're going to get right down to it. I'm going to throw the GoPro on. We're going to start tossing our magnet and we're going to see if we can find anything here today. All right, guys, today we are back out on the boat. We are at the old concrete wall and I have my 360 degree magnet with me today. Alex is also going to be throwing a 360 magnet magnet, double trouble up in the boat. We have seriously been pulling some crazy things out of here. I'm talking pickaxes, TVs, something's leaking oil, right? I don't know, man. There is some crazy stuff going on here. Check it out, you guys. I cleaned the boat. This is honestly probably the cleanest you're ever going to see it for the rest of the year. All the mud's gone on the floor. Look at the walls are white again. Look, at you can even see my stickers. All right, guys, let's start tossing and see what we can find here today. Ready to go here. We got our trusty brute boss, baby. 360 megas are insane. Oh my gosh! 
<laughs> Literally, my first throw, you guys, look at I found the front part of a bike. Like right in between there is where the bike tire goes. Unreal. Wonder if we pop that sucker right off of the bike or what? Oh, look at that. You can see a little bit of red paint up in there. Oh, and a little green. And look at what else is on there. I got me the old Sparky. Holy cow, you guys. What do you think that one is? The old Champion brand? I have no clue. It's got green rings on there. We got the old... Bzz, bzz. I wish I could have remembered the exact date. I could have had like an anniversary. Did you really? Yeah, yeah this is the first And you still have it. Still have Holy it. cow. Remember when I did those TikToks for them? This is the first Oh my time. gosh. That was like 14 months. That lasted months. that long? Yeah. Wow, that's There's, pretty good, uh, dude. Hardly any chips out of this thing, dude. Very high quality. Like if I were to buy another one, it would be another one of these. Oh my gosh, dude, literally my second throw. You guys, we were just talking about Alex's, his magnet right here. He's had that thing for over a year. Yeah, it's got this new uh, aluminum what, carabiner. That's so crazy. I can't believe you have not lost a magnet yet. Yeah, yeah. Seriously, there is just so much cool stuff. Throw number two, I caught me the hammeroo. There's definitely gonna come a day though where we don't find anything else in here. So for now, I'm loving it. You guys, look at this little blade Alex just found. 440 stainless china. That thing looks like a mini pizza cutter. Maybe it's some special type of razor blade? I don't know. That is pretty funky looking. What the heck is this? I got something here. I like must have landed right on it. That feels weird. Oh, hold on. Oh. What on earth, dude? That feels like plastic. Or I mean, like rubber. What the heck? Oh, I caught like the clips on there, the hinges. But what do you think? Hey, dude. Yeah, a window seal or something. Look at you can see the glass shards still stick, sticking out of it. An SUV, like the rear window. Like the back window? Yeah, you're right. Yep, you're right. That's exactly what it is. You guys, there's a little bit of writing on here too. Look at that, it says GM something. It's kind of hard to tell. And if you look, there's like the trunk latch part. This is definitely like the back window of a maybe an SUV or something yeah, like or the, a van. Like the glass, and then you got the door, you know. Holy cow, you guys. Could you imagine if there's like a whole vehicle in here? <laughs> or even like a big chunk of one? Like, I don't even know. Who knows what was going on? I thought I felt a little weight, but it got a lot lighter all of a sudden. Look at this one here. That is definitely some kind of shock. What do you think that's off a screen door? What does that say? Oh, yeah, LGR. That is definitely what that is, you guys, because you can see the little stopper on there still. And there was a little white, what I think is maybe like a bike brake cable or something, some kind of cable. Look at that one, man. Caught me the old butter knife from 100,000 years ago. Holy cow, that's how you know that one's old, you guys. Usually when I find silverware, it's still silver. This thing is rusted right out. Now we just need us some bread. Lift off. Oh! Ooh, yeah, dude, that's a keeper. Got me the old flat blade screwdriver there. The old yellow handler. <laughs> Thought I felt something. Now it's probably over this way. Ooh, a dead floater. Look at that guy. It's a little, what do you call it? A little something. Rock bass. Ooh, I got something here, Heavy. Ooh, what is this here? I don't know what that is. Looks like a piece of scrap something, but look at this, you guys. Whoa, is that some kind of like Dude, that's obviously shaped like a shoe for sure. Is this maybe some kind of like old school thing that you would find in like new shoes to, to hold its form? I don't know. Why would it be metal though? That's kind of weird. Definitely shaped like a shoe. That's all I know. The old shoe shape -a -roo.
Oh, I just sucked right to something and it's coming up. I love that feeling. We just, we sucked right to it, dude. Whoa. Oh, look, I can see prongs. Dude, yes. No way, you guys. Look at that. And the handle's still intact, too. You gotta be kidding me, man. Usually when we find something with a wooden handle, you guys, it's dwindled right down to a toothpick. This thing is in like brand new condition. Seriously, there's like nothing even wrong with this. Unreal, man. Look at none of the prongs are broken. They still feel pretty sturdy too. Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> Might as well be brand new. <laughs> Cash money. Oh, what is this? Uh-huh. Nice and slow. Oh my, that's kind of heavy. What do I got here? What the heck is that one? Looks like some kind of broken off chunk of something here. You can see it broke here and here. I don't know, maybe some kind of fire pit ring top? I don't know. You can see a little tab on there like you could slide this or something. I don't know. Maybe like the bottom part of a grill, like the ash remover part? I don't know, you guys. I am like strong arming us right to something, oh, yeah. dude. Oh, this one is I'm telling you, there's something right here. And I think again, this is the same spot where I said we should bust out the claw. I'm telling you, there's something right here. I got it, it's moving. It is. Come on. Here it comes. Oh my goodness, it's moving. What is it? What is it, dude? Oh my God. No. Holy cow, look at this one. Blush Quest. Holy cow, you guys. We got the old white tire. It looks like a kid's bike, obviously. My goodness, man. And that smells like oil. Do you smell that? I think we're getting a little bit closer to figuring out what that oil spill is, you guys. Something down there, man. What is that? Is that like plastic? Dude, I think it caught me the old broom handle. <laughs> Look at you can even see his duct tape. I don't think you're sweeping much with that bad boy no more. Look at that one, you guys. You can tell right away what this is. This is definitely like some kind of little metal frame from a speaker. And who knows what kind of speaker. That is a pretty small one. Definitely not out of a car or nothing, I wouldn't think. I think I know what this is. Actually, at first I thought it was just a piece of scrap. Then I thought it might have been like the handle for something. But if you look closer, I think this is actually part of like an animal trap. Something about you put your foot in there and press on that and whoosh, you get snapped up in there. Heck yeah, you guys, this is definitely an old school animal trap. Oh, what is this? Looks like some kind of handle or something, or maybe not, you guys. Looks like some kind of piping piece or something here. A cooling tube? Coolant. Coolant for a vehicle? Yes, absolutely. Huh, pretty soon we're gonna be able to build ourselves a car. My goodness. Super funky, man. Oh, what is that? Big, long something. What the heck is that? Maybe part of a broken fishing pole? Oh no, I think this is actually a tent pole, you guys. You can see it's splintered here, and this would be the connection piece where you stick another piece in. Definitely a tent pole there. But look at this here, you guys. It looks like we got us a kickstand. That is a big, heavy-duty kickstand.
I think I got something here. I definitely do. Nice and easy. Oh, here we go. Oh, yo, what is that? Something with a handle. What is that? Definitely some kind of scraper. I think I've seen these before. What the heck are these used for? Plaster or something? I can't remember. And I'm thinking you could probably remove this blade here and throw a new one on. So honestly, this is probably still good yet, you guys. What does that say there? Use blade number hula la 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 USA. I'm gonna set that aside. That's a big old file. Look at that one, you guys. This is almost turning into the old file aisle. I'm pretty sure we're getting close to about a handful of these things now back here. And seriously, just look at how caked thick that rust is on there. Oh, I'm rolling something here. What is this? That's got some weight for sure. Whoa. What the heck? Is that like teeth on there or something? Wait, that's gushy. Or wait, is it? What the heck is this, man? You can tell there's definitely like gears or some kind of teeth on there. It's a big marshmallow on a stick. <laughs> this thing is pretty heavy, you guys. It's definitely something with some gears or teeth on there. But what? I have no clue. Whenever I can't figure out what something is, there's a good chance nine times out of 10, somebody down in the comments is gonna know what this is. Heck is going on here? Pulling us to something. Maybe. Oh, there's a little weight on there. Hey, look at I caught me the rest of the old Christmas tree. You guys, the last time we were out here, I pulled a couple branches off of what looks like a fake Christmas tree. And now we found some more. That's actually probably like good fish bedding down there. They probably like, the fish probably like something it's like this. Aquarium. Right. It's the same stuff. Yeah. Know. Sorry about that, Frank. He's shaking his fist. <laughs> That's hot. It's warm. You're a liar. Warm Let me feel it. It's warm. Unless I'm just losing it, man. It is kind of warm. Is that weird? What the? <laughs> that is. <laughs> that is kind of weird, man. I don't know. That is really weird. That is warm with the touch. I don't know <laughs> what the heck just happened. It came from freezing cold water. Yeah, this water is probably only 50 degrees, if that, and this is like I hot. noticed that immediately because I have small holes in my gloves and I touched it there like that's warm. Shoot, I think that's... Heck yeah. I am something here, dude. Oh my gosh, no, we're slipping. I have a pretty darn good feeling, man, unless it's I got it. Up there. I got it. Why does that feel so heavy? It doesn't even look that, that heavy. Ooh. Crank, yeah, look at it. It definitely does look like some kind of crank. The one past down there, that um, the bolt crank or the, the Oh, crank. the loading yeah. thing down. Yeah, the that might be what that is. You guys, way up this wall here, I don't know if you've seen it in previous videos, there's actually like a big metal frame bolt loading thing. And this looks like some kind of crank that's maybe missing the handle on there. So I'm guessing maybe this could be for something like that, like some kind of big heavy duty crank. Who knows what that crank is for? Crank something. The heck is that? I like landed right on something, dude. I did too. Huh. Right up against the wall is just about, oh my gosh, the nails. Oh, that is, a door. that is a doorknob. Heck yeah, dude. If you guys seen one of our previous videos here, it's funny because I actually pulled out a double, like both ends of the doorknobs still, still stuck together. This style of doorknob here is pretty old, you guys. I They definitely don't make them like this no more.
Ooh, some here. No kidding. Yep, took a little second to snap it out of the water. What the heck is this? Bro, it's a little oh, toy truck. So ah, I am so lucky. Holy cow. You guys, if you it's remember in one of our previous toy. videos, I also found that little toy car. This thing doesn't have any wheels on it, but who cares? It's not dented and beat up, really. Honestly, if you could clean this up, pretty easily you guys that is so super cool man if you would like to see me restore this piece right here make sure to go check out my restoration channel the fisher restorations unreal you guys super cool <laughs> i think i got something again dude the very next throw yeah no kidding this one's kind of heavy. Oh, what is that? What the heck is that, man? Looks like some kind of scoop type piece oh, or a something. Little <laughs> a little rowboat. <laughs> the old banana scooper. Whoa, what is this here? Check this thing out, you guys. Something with like three rings on there. I don't know what the heck this might be. I mean, for real, I don't know. Some kind of fishing pole holder? I doubt it, man, that's a funky one. Something with the three rings on there. Bloop, bloop, bloop. And it sure is starting to get dark, man. We do not have much longer. I don't even know how well you're gonna be able to see right now on the camera. Probably not too good. But I think I got something. So we ain't going home yet. What is this? I'm definitely pulling something. Like a chunk of like a stone Ooh, here we go. Another familiar piece whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's just the bike tire. Maybe oh, and I was going to say, it's time. not white, so it's definitely not off of this oh, bike. Yeah. Dude, seriously, this is like a bike graveyard back here. I don't even know how many bikes total we're up to, but tons of bike stuff down there. Look at that. You could still pump her up full of air. Oh, there's something else on here, too. Look at this. Whoa. What in the world? That is funky looking, you guys. What do you think that is? Look at that, there's like teeth on there, dude. Holy cow, I don't know if this is some kind of handle piece here, but what would that be for? I don't even know. That is pretty funky. I'm guessing there was some more blades on this side here, but they look like they're snapped off. Super weird, you guys. Whoa. I just stuck to something decent, dude. Like almost immediately. What is this? See a bunch of bubbles too. Pulling something to me or what? Oh yeah, it's on there, dude. What do I got here? Oh my goodness, that sucker's heavy. What is that? I can't even tell you guys something here hold on a second we definitely gotta wash this bad boy off you can't even make out what that could be huh whoa heck yeah dude once you get all the mud off of there look at that thing what the heck do you even think that is almost looks like some kind of valve or something but it couldn't be because it's in the middle of the shaft here. What the heck is that? That's a weird looking piece, you guys. Super weird, check that one out. Check that one out, you guys. He calls himself a little white rim. What do you think, what'd you say that's off of? Like a John Deere or something. John Deere, the old John Deere rim. It's almost getting too dark for me to even see. <laughs> I really don't know how much the camera can see. Oh my gosh, that sounded like, um, like a, I heard a thong, like, 
like a box, like a metal box, dude. Hold on. What is this? Yeah, dude, oh my gosh. Hold on, we're gonna hit the stupid wall again, man. I just pushed us off of it. Get the heck out of here. I got something. Oh, oh my gosh, what is that? Yo, it's like dangling by a cord or something. I don't even know what you guys can see on the camera anymore because it's getting super dark out, you guys. But look at this, it looks like you can definitely see wires coming out of that thing. See that? Yeah, I do. What the heck? Is it a lamp? Yeah, oh, it is a lamp. You're not kidding. You're probably right. Or wait, no. Well, this thing here. Oh, you're right. Base. This yeah, is the true. base of it because you can see the feet on here, you guys. There's four little yeah, feet on this yeah, thing. Yeah, and look at it. It's still got part of the plug on there, too. Holy cow, that looks like an old plug. Holy cow, you guys. We caught us an old lamp. All right, you guys. That sun is gone. And honestly, towards the end of the video there, I don't even know what you could even see on the GoPro footage. You guys, I absolutely love finding little toy cars and stuff like this. We're going to go ahead head off the river, you guys. If you enjoyed this video today, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me. And don't forget to subscribe. Make sure to stay tuned and I will catch you on the next one.